98 years ago here in Dayton, Tennessee, there was a trial in 1925. It was the Great Scopes Monkey Trial, and it was held right here in this building, right up there, on that floor right up there. It was about a school teacher who was teaching evolution. It was against Tennessee law to do that at the time. Clarence Darrell, attorney for the defense. William Jennings Bryan was the attorney for the prosecution for the state. In the end, Darrell lost the case to Bryan and Scopes was fined $100, but it was appealed to the Tennessee Supreme Court and it was overturned due to a technicality, but the court still kept the Butler Act, which Scopes had violated, as constitutional. <laughs>